He's about to land in the middle of the road. You can't move. What actually was that? Like? We thought we were going to get them back when they were coming back to loaf, but we got an early morning surprise. I think we were getting birds that got bumped from people over there. Uh, other than that, we had a few that were coming back to loaf. We had a lot of them fly over us because they were being hunted and they had just gotten shot at like 30 seconds ago. Um, other than that, I mean, still awesome. We had 18 geese. We shot super well, way better than yesterday. Um, yeah, I went through the not boy, even half the boys box. on the right, they were shooting really well. And other than that, it was a good day. How did uh, day two go? Uh, today went really good. We, uh, we set a specific spread. Worked really well. Trent will tell you a little bit more about that. Um, birds worked really tight in our faces. Landed really good. We shot really good. So. It was a banger. Tomorrow should be really good too. Really good day. <laughs> it was a lot of fun. Not knowing what to expect, not knowing if there were going to be birds coming to that today because we scouted yesterday and they weren't there. Two days ago they were there. So 
showed up, actually bumped a few birds off the roost and uh, looked at it. The day that there were birds there, we were able to see exactly how they were. So we set a spread exactly how they were. And it was a really realistic spread. I really liked how it looked and the geese liked how it looked too. And we were able to get birds finishing at 15 yards, probably tops, like it, it was perfect. And it was a lot of smaller groups coming in, triples, <clears throat> pairs, a lot of singles. We did have a little bit, not really a bigger flock. The bigger flocks like to give us a little bit of a look and then just fly off the opposite direction. But um, 18 birds down, nothing to complain about. And I'm really excited for tomorrow. Today was a really good hunt. Uh, Trent and Colby set up a real realistic spread for us. So that was really good as we were uh, bl uh, blending in all the blinds. Uh, had to learn the gun, my new gun a little bit, so did a lot of missing, but did a lot better than the previous days. And 18 is nothing to complain about, so hopefully tomorrow's a little better. So today, um, we went in kind of a little nervous that we weren't going to see geese because we went yesterday, scouted a little bit, and we didn't see any geese actually on the sandbar that we were planning on hunting, but Trent felt confident, so we all kind of rolled with that, and went there, bumped a few geese off. We didn't know they were roosting there, but stayed confident and ended up getting some early birds that were just flying around. We pulled them in and other than that, I mean, we shot super well compared to the first day. Uh, had some gun difficulties, but other than that, um, everything went super well. Got 18 birds down, looking for a pretty good hunt tomorrow, so pretty excited. Going good. So today was a really good hunt. We had a lot of fun. Uh, I had a lot of camera issues. Uh, big one was forgot my tripod early in the morning. We were about 15 minutes out and I was like, forgot the tripod and it, there was no point in turning around. So I ended up putting the camera on Kobe's blind bag and it worked. It was just a pain. The angle was a little bit different from yesterday. So that was cool. But um, so I really wasn't too motivated to uh, put the Nikon back there and get the behind the blind shots. But we ended up re-brushing our blinds about, mm, what, halfway through. We did a all right job this morning and then it, we had a slow period and we went and cut more and it, we brushed it in really good. It ended up looking really good. So uh, we uh, passed the GoPro around. I, I wore it quite a bit. Colby wore it for some. Uh, I got a lot of GoPro clips. I didn't get a whole lot of the Nikon, but tomorrow Hopefully I'll have my P's and Q's together. I'll uh, got the Nikon, got the Canon, and I got the GoPro. So hoping to have three different cam camera angles on a single flock. So I'm excited for tomorrow and to just see what tomorrow holds. And excited to go to bed. Stay tuned. Oh yeah. Night. Trent, what did we uh, accomplish? What did we accomplish? Well, a lot of geese. A lot of geese. How many geese? Ask Anthony. Anthony, how many geese? How many geese? Uh, a lot. A lot. A lot of geese. Give me a number. Lot. Like 300 geese. 300 plus probably. <laughs> a lot. And about a thousand mallards. Gonna be a good day. Hopefully. Got permission from a blind old lady. Hope she remembered she gave us permission. Oh. She uh, wants tomorrow, cheese. Tomorrow. She's like, what are you guys doing? Did you guys <laughs> tell her you would bring her cheese? Yes. Yep. She loves We're bringing cheese. her cheese. Hell she loves yeah. Wisconsin cheese. Her little chihuahua tried to bite my ankle off, but, you know. It was me, It was worth the hunt. You know. Worth, worth the, the hunt. hunt. It will be worth the hunt. Oh, so. sure. Sure. All right.